Joe Biden has taken the helm as the 46th president of the United States. President Biden used his inaugural address to urge people to come together to heal. Biden declared that democracy has prevailed as he took the oath at the U.S. Capitol. Security was extremely high for today's events, coming just two weeks after an angry mob stormed the Capitol building. Also sworn in today was Vice President Kamala Harris, making history for many reasons. She's the first woman, the first black person, and the first person of Asian descent to hold the office. Kelly Land's Kelly Volk talks with a woman about what this day means for her. Willette Capers spent part of her morning tuning in to the inauguration. Oh my goodness, I was so excited to watch that thing. Ladies and gentlemen, the Vice President-Elect of the United States, Kamala Debbie Harris and Mr. Douglas Imhoff. Capers is particularly excited about the country's new vice president. Knowing that she's an HBCU grad, I'm an HBCU grad, historically black college and university, um, and to know that my vice president looks like me, not only in color, but also as a woman that identifies, you know, as a cisgender woman. Um, and so, you know, it's really important that, you know, I get to see this in my lifetime. Not only did I have a male black president, but I also have a vice president in my lifetime that looks like me. I Kamala Davy Harris. The historic moment can give hope to others. For so long, especially for people that look like me, for, you know, women of color, you know, we've been told that we can't. Um, and she, you know, took the opportunity to prove to us, no, you can. Don't listen to what you know, the world and what society tells you. We Capers says Harris is showing the sky is the limit, no matter who you are. I um, hope that, you know, the little girls um, around the world that look like me realize that they can be everything that they want to be and more. In Sioux Falls, Kelly Volk, Kelly Land News. Capers also says she recorded the inauguration on her DVR so she can watch it again.